And we begin with Stephen Tuitt, Tom, a defensive end from Georgia who's already said he's going to play for Notre Dame. Yeah, it came down to Notre Dame and Georgia Tech. He had 10 sacks last year. When you look at him in person, he looks like a power forward in basketball. Big, strong kid. He's got a great frame. Probably wound up weighing 280 or 290. Just what the doctor ordered for the Irish, who really are lacking talent at the defensive end position. By asking this question, you decommitted, you committed to Georgia Tech, decommitted. You committed to Notre Dame, decommitted. You sure about this? Is this set in stone? It's set in stone. Okay, what, what sold you on Notre Dame again? <laughs> um, you know, basically what they have is a prestigious school, and um, you have a lot to offer after I graduate, and during that, I have a great college experience with football and academically. Hey, Stefan, this is Tom Lemmy, and I, I met you about a year ago in a snowstorm. You and your mom drove uh, out to meet me at the Holiday Inn there in Georgia, and I knew at that time I was looking at a ball player, looked like an NBA power forward. Now, you, you prefer playing defensive end, with your size and frame, you think you might be moved inside sometime in the next couple of years, or you you think you're going to be staying at defensive end? Um, with the defense that they run, I probably might stay at the defensive end spot, but basically it's the defensive tackle spot. So, hey, Stephon, this is Coach Raw. Congratulations. I, I'm just curious. Now, of all the places you visited and the things that you did on the recruiting trail, what the part, which part of the recruiting process did you enjoy the most? Was it the official visits? Was the phone calls? Uh, was it the attention? Which, which part of the process did you enjoy the most? Um, be able to travel. Um, got a chance to see things that I've never seen before that most um, high school players was able to see. And I'm blessed and I'm glad I was able to see that. And Stefan, have you had a chance to, to meet Aaron Lynch? You guys are going to be going in there as uh, really the two big names of this Notre Dame recruiting class. You, you both play defensive end, so uh, you guys are about to go on a, a four or five year mission together here. Uh, yes, sir. He, um, he's a great guy. Got a chance to play him in the Army All-American game. He's a great football player, and I uh, can't wait to be booked games with him. I saw you guys down in uh, San Antonio. You were fantastic. I, you were a terrific defensive end. So is Aaron Lynch. Um, Georgia Tech is also a very good academic school and it's close to home. Was it really difficult for you to kind of turn away from them and head up north towards South Bend? Um, yes, sir. Um, it, was, it was a hard choice. It was two great colleges and, um, you know, both had great coaches I was very close to. Um, I just had looked down the pros and the cons with my mother. And um, I prayed on it, and um, I just came out with the best choice. Now, now, this weather we're having here in Austin, Texas, is getting you ready for your travels up to <laughs> South Bend. Uh, so you're getting acclimated to, to, to freezing cold weather? Yes, sir. <laughs> tell, us again, tell me a little bit more about Brian Kelly, your thoughts on him and, and, and the rec him recruiting you. What, what appealed to you? What attracted you to his style of recruiting and the program in general? You talked about the history, but uh, this team has struggled in the last few years, although they did have a pretty good year last year with him at the helm. Um, he's a great guy. He knows what he wants to do. He, um, his plan for the future is to win, and um, you know, he's a winning coach. And um, he also knows what he wants to build, and he got the people to do it, and everybody came down. And so he wasn't upset team. with you when you decommitted? Um, you like the prodigal son, you got to come <laughs> back home? <laughs> No, they're kind of confident that I might come back, but um, you know, they they never gave up on me. They never quit it, and um, they stayed with me. Cool. Well, congratulations, man. Good luck there. Thanks.